final game in the first round from the Rosemont Horizon in Rosemont, Illinois, on the outskirts of Chicago. Midwest Regional and the LSU Fighting Tigers take on the California Golden Bears. Vern, the players at Cal received a little added inspiration yesterday from one of the greatest athletes of our time. Michael Jordan addressed the team. He told them to play as a team and to make a memory of the tournament. He didn't mention his winning shot against Georgetown in 1982. Well, the players were somewhat stunned. They were actually amazed. Jason Kidd told me most of them sat there with their mouths open. Vern? Winner gets Duke, and Duke looked most impressive in game three here at Rosemont Horizon. California controls. K.J. Roberts has it. LSU will show a variety of defenses. They haven't shot the ball that well all season. They've been able to win because of their defense. Jason Kidd, too strong with the first shot. Mike Hansen comes down with it. Kidd makes the steal. Feeds it inside. Hendricks with a turnaround. Gets his own follow and puts it in. Brandon. And the rebound for Jason Kidd. Here's Cal in transition. Three on two. Right side. No, Lamont Murray. Wake him up, young fella. Nifty couple of moves. They want to score in transition. Look at Kidd. And the follow. Look at Lamont Murray. <laughs> He's a high riser. He goes left and short with a shot. Kid. Alley. Oh. oh. <laughs> kind of a 2 3 matchup. Grigsby. And I thought California needed to do three things well to win adjust to changing defenses, score points off their defense and rebound. In the last few possessions, they've allowed LSU second shot. Kid gets this one and bumps the lead up to 14 to 10. But you get open with your feet. Hammock did a nice job there. Murray did a nice job there. Jamie Brandon for three from the corner. No good. And California running. K.J. Roberts puts it up. The back <laughs> of the glass and in. That's one that the backboard stopped. <laughs> That wasn't an intentional bank. Bound for O'Hare Airport. <laughs> Low-flying aircraft. It's 18 to 12. 11, 12 to go. First half of play. California jumped out to a 12-2 lead. LSU fought back within two. They now trail again by six. And here's Cal, Stevie Johnson. And then Ryan Jamison tips it in. Part of it is due to the fact that he knows the center position is his. I mean, he played behind Shaquille O'Neal the last couple of years. Here's a chance to tie Jamie Brandon. Hello. Brandon penetrates. Jumper will not fall. At the other end, Grigsby. From Kidd. This is what we talk about when we say a feel for the game. Catch the outlet pass, get your head up immediately. And look how he took something off of that pass. I mean, he laid it up in the air. That was what we call a teardrop pass. Four and a half remaining in the first half of play. The Golden Bears were out by as many as 10. LSU came back to tie it. And now California has broken a 22 all tie with two foot baskets. Persistence pays. That was buffet style on the backboard, 20 of seconds. For the Tigers that time. Too strong. Into the hands of Paul Johnson for LSU. Quick pass to Brandon. And a quick defensive job by mm. LaPond Murray. Don't give up on the play at either end. See, Brandon thinks he's all alone, and he goes to the two-foot hop. See, if he went with one foot, he would have made this shot. But Murray got back because Lamont took the ex actually because Brandon took the extra time to go off two feet. Hello! But he's always got his head and chin up, see? Leaves it behind him, and there's Lamont Murray. Mark it up! Dale Brown wipes... Uh, a bit of perspiration from his forehead. 10-4 lead in fast break points. And a seven-point edge for California. Mismatch here. Somebody should get a good shot. That's a pretty good one. 
That's the end of the first half of the score, California 36, LSU 29. Boy, he's having a nice game. Missed some good shots in that first half. It was only 4 or 14, but for the most part, stayed within himself. Oh. Folks, Clark liked it. 38-32. <laughs> Take a look at this. Watch this hook move. Bang! He's gone. What a spin move to the cup. Lamont, don't show him everything tonight now. <laughs> Keep some in the bag. Blocked by Caesar. Paul Johnson to Caesar. Whoa! Goal Timmy. Lamont Murray has showed you his game. Now he wants to show you his hops. Caesar in transition, and Murray goes way upstairs. Roberts. Nope. Grigsby, good position for the rebound. But the shot and the follow is good. Lamont Murray. There's the entry pass. Harmon kicked it back in the corner. Caesar, and it is blocked and knocked out of bounds. Who is that? Of course, it's Lamont Murray. That's three blocks, <laughs> a steal, three assists, 17 points, and eight boards. All of which is why you call him what? A stat sheet stuffer. Left-handed, blocked. The kid goes back and gets it. Looks for somebody, finds Roberts. Now Hendrick, basket down, player down. He's a legitimate 6'2", 6'3", and he goes right at about 200, and there's nothing soft on it. <laughs> 11 points, Grigsby with the offensive putback. As they typically always do. Williamson one of two. And LSU is up by one. 4-19, and they've got the ball. Williamson. That's for three. And it's a four-point LSU lead. Murray with the counter. Got it. Strong basket. You can do it. So can I, says Lamont Murray. Mm. Murray slipped as he went to receive the pass. Now back to the oh, shot. No. Oh, no, Lamont. Oh, my. <laughs> LSU and California tied at 64. Both teams with a timeout left. Team fouls 12 and 9. Possession arrow for California. 22 seconds to go. What do you like for Kel? I really like Lamont Murray in an isolation or Jason Kidd in an isolation. The key for California, obviously, is to take the shot with about four or five seconds left so they have an opportunity for a second shot if they miss, but they don't give LSU a chance to go to the other end. I think it's Lamont Murray or Jason Kidd in some type of isolation. Murray gets it back to Kidd. Fox shows five. Here's Kidd driving, spinning, putting it up. Gracious. Let's see how they set up here. All right. Actually, nobody's on the ball. Everybody's just going to go after it when it's thrown the length of the floor. Anderson to inbound. Thomas out of bounds. And the game is over.